personally believe that there is something of yeah. that. Well, there's an unspoken word out there in the NBA when it comes to competing against your peers. Daniel Mwaba misses that one. Now it's set up. Mo Wagner finishes. Nice give by Russell Westbrook and the Washington Wizards, but they've settled on one in back-to-back -back games here with Beal and Westbrook joined by Matthews, Achimura, and Wagner. And there's a three-point hit. I'm making a long two, I beg your pardon. John Wall's in the ball. No one feels soft, so sorry for you in the NBA. You gotta play and compete regardless. Uh, no question. Rockets are 11 and 15. The Wizards at 7 and 17. Nice pull by Rui Achimura. Cousins will fire a three. He'll do that on occasion. Three-point shooting's actually been decent this year, over 33%. Here's Matthews, and he knocks it down. Good to see you. That's the kind of year it's been. I mean, a two-way guy, all of a sudden, he's starting for the Washington Wizards, and as you said, doing a pretty good job. Ooh, look at Daniel House going fundamental off the window. Into the corner. That three is no good. And here is House going in for the dunk. The Waba, his second. The headliner, John Wall, returning to Washington, D.C. Jay Sean Tate buries a three to find a chance in the NBA, and he's found it and made the most of it. Good ball movement there. Extra pass to Beal, and he buries a three in the corner. Just great offensive execution. Everyone touching the basketball. And then you know what? It ends up in the hands of the leading scorer in the NBA all along. <laughs> and answering on the other end is John Wall. A video tribute for John Wall plan. They're gonna do it again when fans are allowed back in. Look at Beal go, and all of a sudden, Grant, that's nine on the board for Bradley Beal. There's no shot blockers inside right now with Cousins and you know, obviously Christian Wood out. So Washington early attacking, getting in the paint, and of course getting to the rim. Quite the impressive win. For the Wizards and Scott Brooks, you know, he's looking for the small victories as Beal misses. Robin Lopez with the put down. No team has endured as much and been impacted as much uh, from COVID as this Wizards team. So you're right. Five and five is time for celebration as Lopez scores once again inside. In the last two possessions. And we talked to Scotty Brooks. He was very pleased with Lopez's Ooh. activity, although Wall showing some action. Activity right there at the rim. <laughs> Wounds will be healed, and I think they will. And you know, John's time there was just incredible. What he meant for that organization and city, as you talked about, not just on the court but in the community. Alex Lynn did not play yesterday. Alex Lynn was brought in to fortify the front court, but Lopez is playing well. A little far out there to guard Boogie Cousins, though. And, and figure it out, and that's what they're trying to do. They've certainly been playing better as of late. And a good ball movement by the Wizards. Berton setting up Beal perfectly. Cousins for three again. This time it's short. Berton's with a rebound coming off a season high eight yesterday. Berton's will pull up and knock down the three. And there it is. I pulled a Zion Williamson rookie card. Yeah. That's, that's, that's pretty sweet. Uh, you keep that. You need to uh, probably make that available somehow. As Robin Lopez scores inside. We'll figure something out. Maybe we'll ask Twitter, the Twitter universe, to give us an idea of what to do with that card. No, no doubt about it. Jayshon Tate scores inside. Two longest active streaks going. Both in Sacramento. There's Westbrook gets inside and scores just his second field goal. Outside this year, but when he gets into the paint, so dangerous to stop. And I love him finishing with that left hand. And Cousins. I guess he's proving us wrong. Shot clock is off. Washington the chance at the last shot here. Westbrook gives it up. Bertans a fall away three is good. Thomas Bertans has been struggling to get his stamina back. An acting success story, I understand, from your days as a wizard. I mean, you did a lot of great commercials. <laughs> while you were there. So you're a very familiar face and name. As we see DeMarcus Cousins get stuck inside and... Ooh, getting late clock here. House Ooh, knocks it down. All right, so tell me what your thoughts are about the return of John Wall. Jameson, Deshaun Stevenson, Jerry Jeffries. A lot of good guys contributed to that successful run that we had um, in, in the early 2000s. 
what is this team? What, what could they be in a tough Western Conference with all their players healthy? Uh, well, listen, in the Western Conference, they could uh, they could make the playoffs if healthy. If and Scott Brooks, and you mentioned all the, the major COVID problems that the Wizards dealt with. Had seven players at one point. Jay Sean Tate. Beal able to hang, goes off the glass. And, and if they go small uh, to a team struggling to find its groove, particularly with new pieces. A lot of these teams gasping for air and uh, anxious for an all-star break. Nice take by John Wall. Wall. House has been extremely active tonight. He's looked good. Clears that rebound. That's the field goal percentage so far. Tate strong inside. Since 2018-19, so it's since his days as a wizard, Achimura scores inside for the Wizards. They took a three away from Cousins and gave it to Wall. Beal, right there, he's got 15 points. Wall hasn't missed much tonight. He's now six out of 12. Here's Beal, they clear it out. Beal strong inside. He scores on McLemore and a timeout. Wall guarded by Achimura. Wall goes right by him and high off the glass scores the layup. He is really sort of stepping his play up here. And so that is so encouraging long term. Ooh. Wagner dunks it home, is fouled. They actually went back and looked at a three-pointer from the first quarter. Oh, my goodness. Nawaba just attacking the glass. You know, you have to match up. You have to have mobility here as Houston has five small guys. And once again, bad rotations defensively, leaving House wide open for a slam dunk. A great pass by Wall. Quickly down the other end, Bertans with a corner three for the Wizards. Quickly down the other end, Bertans with a corner three for the Wizards. He's hit a couple of corner threes. Now a turnover by Houston. Bradley Beal all the way in. Seven-point Washington lead. Here's Daniel House. McLemore. And McLemore with a layup. Gets by Abdia. Certainly effective. Great finish inside. Westbrook off the window. And there you go, Tim Duncan. Tonight. That's your guy, Tim Duncan, right there. Uh, David Nwaba at point blank. Westbrook cannot hit the layup, but that kind of night for him. And there's Jay Sean Tate who scores. Wall kicks it. Sterling Brown for three. He's got it. Rockets have struggled from behind the arc tonight. Just four for 18. Brown's an excellent three-point shooter. This time he finds McLemore open in the corner and back-to-back -back threes for the Rockets. Just like that. Play, shoot threes. You always have a chance to get back in it. And a foul on the three ball. Bertans makes it. Going from Latvia to start the year. He was behind on the short ramp up. Just hasn't been able to get loose yet. As Wall takes it to the basket. Another one inside for John Wall. <laughs> Ooh, did not want Bradley Beal going under the temporary stands. Beal, oh, he's so connected on and off the floor. Now he hits another two. <laughs> Unable to break 100 points, averaging 98 points during that losing streak. So third quarter, not a good start for them, but Bradley Beal. Be very interesting to see how the Lakers play this with AD, but that can certainly tip things in the West. There's a steal by Bradley Beal all the way in to score the layup. Easy layup opportunity in transition as a result. And DeMarcus Cousins finally scores for Houston. Speaking of Achilles injuries, both Wall and DeMarcus Cousins, those brutal Achilles injuries. Wall, a little dribble into a pull-up. Pull he knows he has to pick it up here in the third quarter. Just finds his rhythm with that little Dance dribble, as you said, D.A. Answer with a three-pointer on the other end. Washington by 11. Rockets have had just one lead. It was brief in the second quarter. And there's Jay Sean Tate. Corner three is good for the man from Ohio State. 
to here in this second half. He spins off Achimura. Oh, vintage wall gets his own and the putback. Ball didn't have the legs to get that shot off. House behind the back turns it over. Good defense. And Neto scores the layup. He was looking for contact as well. Forcing turnovers, they score quick. Team that's in the bottom third in most offensive categories, but that's not one of them. Oh, a nice finish there by Guava. They still get on the glass offensively. Guava there in the right place at the right time with the easy putback. Three-quarter is good. And hit that three over the 6'10 Ray Spalding. A kick to the corner. House. Got it. Nice find by John Wall. Houston trying to find some rhythm here late in the third quarter, B.A. Wall's got a double-double. That's his 10th assist, Grant. Here's Neto again. And a little mid-range is good from Howard Neto. Hopefully he can get healthy and get back from that ankle injury. What a beautiful pass inside by Beal. Lopez unable to convert. Yeah, Lopez had a block to look like, and there, Achimura inside. They kept the possession alive, and Achimura makes it a 10-point Wizards lead. Neto's had a nice third quarter here. Westbrook. And Neto on the drive. Neto scores it inside. Another layup in there by Ayo Neto. Ten for the game. And a bad pass. Westbrook turns it over. Into the hands of David Nwaba. He's going coast to coast. Takes on Lopez and scores. David Nwaba taking on the big man. Two more points for him. He's got 11. He has Thomas Bertans. He has been hot from behind the arc tonight, Grant. That's his fifth made three. Beal on the bench here to close the third. You think you can get some stops. But this Washington offense has been electrifying here in his last three or four possessions. <laughs> <laughs> nice leave and a good finish in there by Ray Spaulding. Washington, D.C. We're at Capital One Arena. They are anyway. Brian Anderson with Grant Hill. Sterling Brown scores on the first possession of the fourth quarter. The return of John Wall to D.C. Wall and Beal sitting currently as Alameda misses inside the putback by Mo Wagner. Wagner. Oh, nice pass. Avi on the drive. Patient Mo Wagner. Late January. Three weeks ago. That's three. Westbrook runs down the rebound. He's one away from a triple double. Nice find by Westbrook. And Mo Wagner hammers it home. Up ahead. Westbrook leaves it for Bertans. Count it. A goal 10. Working on Wagner. That's a big 10 clash right there. And Tate can't score it. Ohio State against Michigan. Nice lead. Neto finishes. And I'll tell you what, for a team that, that played last night, just great energy in the transition. Pass by Westbrook. And Neto with the finish, B.A. Westbrook's got 12 assists now, part of his triple-double. 10, 11, and 12 across the line. And Westbrook off the window to second mid-range off the glass. The Mason Jones, I beg your pardon. David Nwaba lost the handle, gets it back, scores it, and one. Rockets know they got to get on a push here. Playing with a lot of injuries tonight. Nawaba finds Jay Sean Tate, two-handed jam. Have to make sure that they value the basketball, work as a unit to get a good shot, and not give up on this game. And that right there, Beal. Right and Wagner had it stripped by Wall. Wagner strips it right back. Wide open for three. Oh, a little salt in the wound for the Michigan man, Mo Wagner. I have an idea. I think next week for that segment, I'm, I'm going to get a red sweater and put it on for the segment. I like that. I like Good that. job, Matt Cain in the truck. I like that. <laughs> Tate Strong gets his own and puts it back. And there's Bertans cutting. No. Tate with a rebound. Under five minutes to go in regulation. Bounce pass to Nwaba. Nice setup by John Wall to David Nwaba. Quick, quick plays, deliberate, quick action, able to get something at the basket. Now they got to get stops, but it's tough. Just so efficient 
mid-range jumper. How about Beal? He's got 37 tonight, Graham. Oh, my God! Nwaba. He's fouled mm. and won. David Nwaba. That's his 10th board. He's got a double-double tonight. John Wall for three. Rockets need it, and they get it. John Wall delivers the three ball for the Wizards. Out of big games, Wall and Beal. Bradley Beal working on Jay Sean Tate. Finds Mo Wagner wide open for three. He's got it. Good answer for the Wizards after the John Wall three. You can't blame him, Grant. Wall played a decade here in Washington. He made a three. They originally gave those three points to the Wizards. That was fixed during the break. There's Jay Sean Tate scoring with a strong hand. We'll now get it organized here. 11 point Washington lead and a turnover. Into the hands of Tate. Tate looking for someone finds Daniel house and one chance at a three-point play for the Rockets And you always have the safety valve in Bradley Beal Jay Sean Tate guards Beal Westbrook left wide open and he knocks down the mid-range As good as Wall's been tonight. He has really struggled from behind the arc just one of seven Westbrook splits the double gives it up Oxymura with a layup uh, Westbrook's got 152 now. Oscar's record at 181. And there's Westbrook. Hammers one home. Does a pull up on the rim. And one for Russell Westbrook.